welcome to episode 1000 bajillion of me making the impossible possible. Meaning, I have to get dressed, I have to get ready in about an hour. My hair is looking like this. And I'm shooting on my affordable vlog camera. Let me show y'all. Yeah, insert the clip. Her. It is 439, so. Let's get to it. Um, it is five fifteen. I was talking to I was talking to my best friend, or well, one of my best friends, being in a lot of different professional rooms and going to formal events, it's like, the natural hairstyles just don't be hitting. And I don't know if that's because I don't know how to properly do them, or they just truly don't be hitting. You know what I'm saying? And I just want to have a better relationship and viewpoint of my hair. Because when you say things like that, people feel like you're anti-black, right? And it's like, obviously, I'm not. I'm black. I'm lickety black. I'm not mixed with nothing. I'm mixed with nippy and nippy. So it's like, yes, I'm full black. And I love natural hair. I just feel like my hair is just so much work. And I just never really took the time out to kind of, I just feel like my hair is just so much work. And I don't be having the time to be worried about that. You know what I mean? Let me do the top and I'll be right back. I primed with um, Benefit Professional, the OG. If you know, you know. So right now, on the camera, I feel like I'm looking like like green. Like a greenish orange. But in real life, I look perfectly fine and normal. I haven't shot... This is like an affordable vlog camera, as I mentioned before. And I haven't shot any um, like beauty content or this type of content with it. I've just shot like literally like vlog style type of things. And I will say for the price point, the features and things that this camera can do is definitely worth the price. But we want to see how this uh, footage come out. I just turned the lights off in my bathroom, and this looks so much better. <laughs> that is weird. That is so weird. I don't know. Maybe the the yellow light in my bathroom messes up the quality of this camera. I mean, the flash is flashing. What? That's pretty cool. Okay. So I guess I'm gonna do my makeup in the dark. Okay, period. When you get new equipment, learning like the best tech and setup for that set equipment, it takes a lot of trial and error. So honestly, you know how that trip that y'all have, don't be making up group chat. Well, guess what? This video might not make it out the dress. I'm just saying. So wish me luck. Hopefully, the quality is giving what I like it to give, you know? Um, concealer, we're using the Born This Way Concealer. I'll make sure everything is down below for the girls who want to know. Trust me, this looks very unorthodox when I'm doing my makeup right now, but it's going to be like, don't even worry about it. Don't even worry about it, sweetheart. I love the way Uche does her makeup. Like, it's literally flawless and seamless. But I'll be honest when I say, I don't feel like the other UK girlies that think like they like invented this certain trend of doing makeup and style and blah 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 like y'all are a little bit delusional in my brain it's a little controversial but y'all are a little bit delusional because I remember the Jackie Dimonds of the world and Patrick Stars and all these people who taught me how to do makeup over the past you know 10 years if not longer and none of them are from the UK and I really feel like the beauty community a lot, like what I'm doing right now, this is very like drag queen coded. Like a lot of the beauty tips and things that we do come from drag queens. Now, I don't know where the drag girlies got it from. Maybe they got it from the UK. I don't know. But I'm just saying that 
I don't know. I just think it's so weird how people always are taking credit for like, or trying to take credit for things. That's like, why do we need to take credit for this? Like, who started what? Blah, 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 blah. Like, it's a fun conversation. Don't get me wrong. But it's also just kind of like, why? Yeah? How much time do you need to get ready? Um, I'm almost done my makeup, and I could do the rest, like, probably on the ride, so. Your eyes, like, like, I pick you up at, like, 6.30, is that good? Oh, I was going to say, like, 6.15, but yeah, sure. All right, I'll see you soon. All right, see you. All right. Bye, love you. Powder's on, as you can see. Multitasking. <laughs> How do y'all do y'all blush? Do y'all start from the cheek and then go up? Or do you start with the cheek and go down? Like, where do you put your blush? Because I like to put my blush here, like all the balls of my cheek up, and then also on my nose, too. And are you really doing your blush if you're not making this face? <laughs> you're not. So for the eyes, we're just going to do like a little bronzer on the lid. All right, let me do my brows. I'll be right back. Um, so I want to use this clip to kind of just clip it up a bit, but I don't really know how to, like, how should I do this? I also kind of like think I should like leave a piece of the hair out like this. Hell no. Nah. Hell no. Nah. It's giving put that sh in the bun. Put that sh in the put, 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 put that sh in the bun. That's what it's giving. Uh, y'all. Let me go figure this out. Okay, y'all. You probably can't see, but this is my dress. I'll try to take pictures tonight. Super cute. And um, I'm going to take my scarf off in the car because, yeah, it's giving no bun. Itself, I love the way my hair felt. Even the mousse kind of laying this ponytail down was really good. The hair scarf on y'all saw. I wore these. What? Oh my, guess what? Celine's in a bathtub right now. I wore these earrings and I really came back so I could show y'all my little lip console that I tried to show y'all in the car, but I don't even know if it, you know, did what it needs to do. If you, if you follow me on Instagram, you see that I did a, like, haul of Tease Cosmetics. That's where these lip products are from. Tease Cosmetics. These are perfect pinky nude for my skin tone. Black on business. Black. Oh, right. Ooh. Lip gloss. So yeah, all the products that I use are going to be in the description. Um, the camera itself, I can't wait to look back and see the footage. It did what it needed to do. Um, I want to play around with it a little bit more, maybe do some more beauty content with it and see, give you guys better notes. But it's definitely going to be on my Amazon storefront. So if you're interested, if you are just now starting out your content creation journey, and even if you are a content creator already, you just want low maintenance, like tech to just take around with you, affordable, whatever the case may be, I think this is a good camera. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This girl. Anyway. But yeah. Thank you.
guys for tuning in to my very chaotic get ready with me I'll see you in the next video Celine, can you say bye? bye